کنفرانس در لندن حفاظت و حقوق ساکنان اشرف محکومیت زندانسازی در لیبرتی می داشت لرد رابین کوربت Now, I know this isn't going to be easy, Val, but I would ask you to say a few words to the conference. Salam Ashraf. Salam Camp Liberty. I want to thank you very much indeed for the very lovely tribute to Robin. And I want to tell you one more thing. Robin Corbett is alive. He's alive in all of us. The spirit and passion that he brought to the work he did since 1981 to make the Iranian resistance known in this country and abroad must not be forgotten and must be built on. And that is the thing that I want you all to do. There is a follow-up. His spirit is in all of us. He always said that we were going to meet her on the steps uh, of the House of Commons or House of Lords and um, I, I intend to be there because uh, the Corbett connection is not broken in this work that we all have to do. My daughter Polly and my son-in-law Nick join me and we are going to continue what he did. Robin wasn't an angel. Let us get that straight. Um, he was quite a stubborn man, but his stubbornness, of course, worked very much in your favor because in 1981 he decided that this was a cause that he could really get behind. Uh, his passion for human rights, dignity, democracy, and the rights of, of women, passions that he brought not only to his work with Iran, but also to all the other, other um, work that he did. Um, and he was a very active, I'm happy to say, very active peer, very active uh, MP. And I've had the most wonderful letters, absolutely wonderful, wondrous actually. Um, uh, one from a, um, a little boy, well he's a man now, um, who said uh, 25 years ago he was on a local paper, the front page, because his bicycle had been stolen. And Robin wrote to him, got hold of him, and said, come and work in our house um, with little jobs and I will pay you and we will buy you a new bicycle. And so that's what he did. And of course he, he, um, 
uh, managed to get this, and he's coming to Robin's funeral uh, on Friday. And it's people like that, that that Robin reached out for. And the NCRI was one of his major passions. He put more work on it uh, than virtually anything else. But when um, some uh, NASA and Hussein came to visit him on his deathbed, his first question was, what's happening at Ashraf? And that was the commitment that he made, and he, he continues it until he died. I want to thank you so much for your wonderful um, tribute. Uh, I love some of the photographs. I haven't seen many of them. I hope we can get copies. Um, his spirit is going on. Uh, he is in this hall with us now. I'm really happy to be here. Yes, it is very hard. So thank you very much indeed, and I'll sign off with what Robin always said. Iran will be free. Yeah.